Wilma coverage now continues on a special edition of Evening Edition. Right now, our city is getting slammed by Hurricane Wilma. Right now, you can also see that that northern iron wall is also barreling. I'm excited on the scene in Key West, Florida, where we are getting slammed down by Hurricane Wilma. Right now, this is a very dangerous situation. We are on storm alert right now in Florida. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. As you can see, we're covering Hurricane Wilma right now in Naples, Florida is a shower of power right now. This is very, everyone's without power right now, actually, in Naples, Florida, because of this Hurricane Wilma. And it also hits places like Miami. It's also a very rough time. As you can see, the waves from Marco Island are also barreling on the coast. Landfall, 6.30 a.m., Cape Romana, Florida. It's moving at 120 miles per hour, moving northeast. And it's protected passes right here. We also have Mike Sedal on the scene. If that makes it also, as we were saying with Hurricane Wilma, that we also could see some very strong winds across the coast. A very bad hurricane. This hurricane reached 195 miles per hour in that seat right there. And that's what makes it so good, is that we've had so many things come and go. But it's not good at all. It's actually very scary that all these little bricks and stones over here could make some very bad wind. Yes, we've also seen some flooding from Hurricane Wilma, as you can see right here. This is the damage. There's also, like, pong spring boxes everywhere. Red fire hydrants are flooded everywhere. It's also a very bad situation, as you can see. Let's track Hurricane Wilma. So this is Hurricane Wilma. It's moving towards Fort Myers and Key West and West Palm Beach. It's moving towards Vero Beach. A very bad place to be. So this is Hollywood, Florida. It's getting... Prettier, pretty nasty over there. So that's what we're doing. 